Good morning, boys and girls, faculty and staff, and everybody else who's watching. It is Friday, March 27th. We're hoping you're doing well today. Uh, so before we move any further, yes, it is pajama day, and I hope you're wearing your pajamas. Please send in those pictures of pajamas if you'd like. Uh, this is what we wear to sleep in, so these are our pajamas. Anyway, uh, so before we move any further, let's check out Elena playing the guitar. Thank you so much, Elena. Great job. Boys and girls, send those pictures in, those videos of you practicing your instruments or your art form. We'd love to see them and, and uh, have them on the daily announcements. All right, so our weather today is very similar to yesterday. Uh, we're going to be cloudy uh, early and then partly cloudy this afternoon. Hopefully the sun will come out. High of 84, winds 5 to 10 miles per hour. It is going to be near a record high today as well. So get outside and enjoy that. Uh, all right, our national day today is National Scribble Day. So, scribbling. My daughter Harper and a lot of you probably do a lot of scribbling. Well, that's an art. That's an art I form. Don't. No, scribble scratch. I don't scribble scratch. Oh, what do you do? You just draw and paint and color. Line. You stay in the lines. Awesome, cool. All right, so today's National Scribble Day. Get out there and scribble. All right, so our birthdays today, Friday, March twenty seventh. We have two birthdays: Skylar Guidry and Audrey Tillery. Happy birthday, Skylar Guidry and Audrey Tillery. And Saturday, March twenty eighth. Let's see, we have Abram Griffin. Abram Griffin, happy birthday. Lillian Flockton, happy birthday. Tanner Bork on Saturday, happy birthday. And also Luke Potter, happy birthday to you. Then Sunday, March 29th. Wow, April is almost here, folks. March 29th, Cade Roby and Lila Dinham. Happy birthday to both of you. All right, so the, what's the joke of the day, Harper? Can you read that? What, what flowers grow and on faces. On what flowers faces. grow on faces? Tulips. 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 Ha ah, ah, Thank you, Dominic, for sending that one in. That was good. Boys and girls, if you have any jokes you'd like me to tell, please send them in. We'd love to hear them. All right, so, and speaking of pictures, we talked about pictures earlier. Check out these wonderful pictures of our students at home today. From our website, here we go. We just go to the left-hand corner at the top. We go to Student Life in Pictures. We've got some great pictures coming in. Boys and girls, please send those pictures to me uh, or your teachers. We'd love to have them so we can post them here and, and uh, showcase them. All right, so we have Avery in second grade enjoying some free time before school work at her mom's office. Oh, there we go, doing some Zern. I love it, I love it. Oh, a little Biagas baby in deep thought. Gotta love that. All right, also doing some work here. It's fantastic. Petros kiddo having some fun here and do not try this one at home. They're climbing up the walls. They're doing it at my house too. All right, Jacob's art, great job. And after he finished the art, Jacob mowed some grass. Thanks for helping out around the house, Jacob. Oh, this is great. Abigail in first grade making a little fish family, some great visual arts. And Miss Lovis, excellent, excellent chalk work. That's beautiful. Dominic. In honor of our sports theme yesterday on Thursday, wearing some LSU gear. Go Tigers! And Sadie in first grade with her sister Cora fishing at Lake Martin. And then we have some volcanoes by Biagas. All right. Thanks so much, boys and girls. Have a great day. Those are some great pictures. Thank you for sending those in. Continue to send those in, please. Boys and girls, also, and parents, I want you to send, send things in that you are thankful for. So you can either write me an email of what you're thankful for. You can draw a picture or, or do some type of artwork that expresses what you're thankful or grateful for. Or you can even send us a video of what you're thankful for. This is a time that we need to reflect and understand that, you know, this is a challenging time, but also we have a lot to be thankful for. One of my things I'm thankful for is this girl right here. All right, boys and girls, faculty and staff, everybody's watching. I hope you have a great weekend, and we'll see you on Monday. And stay awesome today and every day.